Hey, welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at the mayfly nymph. A couple of days ago I went down to the creek and netted a mayfly nymph. If you don't already know, mayflies spend most of their lives in the immature stage, which can range from several months to three years in the water, and then they transform into an adult wing mayfly at the end of their life. When they change to the adult mayfly, their final minutes or hours are spent mating and laying eggs. The egg laying typically happens between May and September, and at that time you can see, down by a body of water, the swarm of mayflies completing the final phase of their life cycle. So let's get close and personal with a mayfly nymph. Okay, so here's our subject for today. Here we have the mayfly nymph. Really small guy. Probably about, oh, two centimeters long. And this is what we're going to be putting under the microscope today. All right, you can see there, look at that. So you can see the, the black eyes there little dots and then you can even see uh, kind of the veins that are running through this animal see here you can kind of see the veins look at that that's a nice good sized blood vessel and these looks like they're leading to the eyes right there and I'm going to show you this is really interesting you can actually see the wings that are being formed see right here you can actually see the wings being formed. Look at that. See that right there? And uh, let me see if I can zoom in before he moves. Look there. You can see right there the end of the wings. And mayflies have four wings, so they got two sets of uh, wings, uh, the front and the back, just like a dragonfly. And take a look at this. This is right at the back of the tail. This is actually where they breathe. So they have gills here, and I believe it's seven gills. And you can see there it's actually moving. Very interesting. You can actually see where it's breathing. Look at that. It's on the bottom of their tail, on the inner side, uh, that they actually take in uh, the water to breathe. So I'm going to, let me see if I can zoom in on this guy, get a better look. Look at that. Is that awesome or what? That is so cool. Looky there. Very interesting the whole all the different parts of the uh, of the mayfly nymph. Now what I did is I actually put a um, essentially a black mouse pad on the bottom. And that way we have a real good contrast between the, uh, uh, between the nymph and the, um, and the background. Look at that. So you can see it's moving its mandibles right now. And you can see how these areas here look like they might be connected on the bottom part of the mandible. Maybe they're the muscles or however. And um, so they'll move at the same time. Look at that. It almost looks like he's trying to eat. So what I've read is, is that they actually can eat algae. Um, they'll eat algae or small protozoa uh, items like that. Again, this is the head. So this vein is going to the blood. This blood vessel is going to the uh, eye over here. And then this blood vessel is going over to the other eye. If you want to learn more about the mayfly, I've added a link to mayfly.org, which has a nice website describing these interesting insects. Hey, thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please check on our other videos on my channel. And if you have any comments or questions, please write them in below. I'd love to hear from you.